rule of Andhra Pradesh. Andhra Pradesh is historically called as the rice bowl of India, as it is endowed with the abundant water resources in the Krishna Godavari Delta region. Andhra Pradesh is also well known for its ancient history and culture and heritage. On this occasion, I would like to share a few thoughts and views with you all. In the past three years, I have had the pleasure of a personally meeting and interacting with the several high-level dignitaries from other states and other countries, public representatives, officials, and common citizens at the Raj Bhavan. A special mention led to be made about the Swarnima Bija Varsha celebrations commemorating the 50th anniversary of India's victory in 1971 war at a program held in Raj Bhavan premises in September last year. I had the honor and privilege of receiving the victory frame brought by the defense officers of Eastern Naval Command from Vishakapatam on its cross-country journey. It was an honor for me to facilitate the war widows and the gallantry award winners of 1971 were with the memento and cash grants on the occasion. The President's Trick Tribute 2022 held in Vishakapatam in the February this year was inaugurated by Honorable President Sri Ramnath Kovind ji and graced by First Lady Shimati Savita Kovind and Defense Minister Sri Rajnath Singh and other dignitaries. It was a historic and a proud moment for the state as it was a spectacular event and it treated for the eye with as many as 60 ships and 55 helicopters displaying the mighty power in mega event. The President's Fleet Review 2022 was followed by Another landmark event, Milan 2022, held in March, in which India's Navy's largest multilateral exercise was held for, a, for the first time in Visakhapatnam, with the participation of 30 countries, with the display of 26 ships, one submarine, and 21 aircraft. I have no doubt to say that these two spectacular events offered a memorable experience for the people of Pusakapatam and will be cherished by then for a long time. My visit to National War Memorial in New Delhi in April this year remains Based in my memory as I had the opportunity to pay tribute to the martyrs and lay wrath at War Memorial as a mark of respect for the brave soldiers and war heroes who led their lives in the service of the nation. The country is celebrating Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav of 75 years of independence in a befitting manner by organizing several programs rem remembering the freedom fighters who martyred to free the motherland from the shackles of British rule. It was a moment of a great pride and for honor for the people of Andhra Pradesh that our Honorable Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi ji has unveiled the 30-foot 
ब्रोंज स्टैचू ऑफ मन्नम भिरुडो श्री आलुरी सीताराम राजू एट ए प्रोग्राम हेल्ड रिसेंटली इन भीमाभरम वेस्ट गोदावरी डिस्ट्रिक्ट इट वॉज ए ग्रेट प्रिवलेज फॉर मी टू पार्टिसिपेट इन द प्रोग्राम टू ऑनर द ग्रेट रिवोल्यूशनरी फ्रीडम फाइटर श्री आलुरी सीताराम राजू विच हेल्ड डियर टू दर हार्ट बाय द पीपल ऑफ द स्टेट एंड हुज नेम स्टील री भरबरेट्स एंड एंड अराउंड द मन्नम ए डिस्ट्रिक्ट द जनवरी दिस इयर देर आर रिपोर्ट्स ऑफ राइज इन द नंबर ऑफ इन्फेंट डेथ्स इन द ट्राइबल एजेंसी रीजन ऑफ एस्ट वाइल विशाखापटम डिस्ट्रिक्ट सपोज टू बी ड्यू टू कैल्शियम डेफिशिएंसी इन मदर्स एंड कंटामिनेशन ऑफ ड्रिंकिंग वाटर आई वाज वेरी मच परटर्ब्ड बाय द रिपोर्ट्स एंड गेव इंस्ट्रक्शंस टू द ऑफिशियल्स ऑफ द ट्राइबल वेलफेयर डिपार्टमेंट फॉर टेकिंग इमीडिएट रिमीडियट स्टेप्स टू रिप्लेस द रस्टेड ड्रिंकिंग वाटर pipelines to provide a second ambulance for emergency service to put a medical team to investigate the issue and to deploy a staff nurse to be stationed in the area it did give me immense satisfaction to inaugurate the thalassemia day केयर सेंटर एस्टाब्लीश बाय आंध्र प्रदेश स्टेट ब्रांच ऑफ इंडियन रेड क्रॉस सोसाइटी इन द रिमोट ट्राइबल रीजन ऑफ पाडेरू इन आलुरी सीताराम राजू डिस्ट्रिक्ट इट मे दिस इयर ऑन द ऑकेजन ऑफ वर्ल्ड रेड क्रॉस डे इट इज अ मैटर ऑफ प्राइड एंड इमेंस प्लेजर फॉर मी दैट i had the opportunity to felicitate eminent persons from sports literature culture art etc who made a mark in their respective fields and won laurels for the state and the country olympians and medal winners pv sindhu e rajini swatik sairaj and ranki reddy and kidambi sukhant among other sports persons padtunsi award winner sri gariki patti nar singh rao dr shankara bhankala adin narayan rao have received felicitations at raj bhavan keeping in view the interests of the students pursuing higher education i have advocated on several occasions that the state universities should conduct their annual convocations on a regular basis as non conduct of convocations in a timely manner would jeopardize the careers and future prospects of the students i am happy to note that the system is now thoroughly streamlined and the universities are promptly conducting their annual convocations in a timely manner in a meeting with the vice chancellor i have also advised them to make up for the time lost owing to covid 19 pandemic by going ahead with regular academic activities the andhra pradesh state branch of indian red cross society received accolades at the national level with two of its officers office bearers receiving the president's gold medals for their dedicated services the andhra pradesh state branch also received 
an award for the second highest membership enrollment. The members of Rector Society have been at the forefront in extending support by distribution of essential commodities and clothes to flood affected victims during the flood in the Raisalima region in December last year. As you are all well aware, the COVID-19 pandemic situation has destabilized the human living across the world till February 2022, though the virus showed signs of slowing down over the next four months, the virus appears to be spreading again with an increase in the number of cases being reported in the recent times. Learning from the past experience, we have to be alert and take all precautions to prevent spread of the virus. I appeal to everyone to continue to wear masks in the public and do your bit in curtailing the spread of the virus. Honorable Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi ji has announced that all persons above 18 years of age will be provided COVID-19 precautions dose free of cost at all government vaccination centers up to 75 days to commemorate 75 years of India's independence. I request all eligible persons to avail the opportunity and take the precaution dose as soon as possible. Andhra Pradesh is blessed with abundant natural resources, fertile land, river basins, extensive canal system, and conducive agro-climatic conditions. The state is also equipped with the abundant human resources with huge potential and a high level of progressive mindset and entrepreneurial aptitude. The state government has always been in the forefront in maintaining a business-friendly ecosystem to attract investments in the industrial sector as the state is well endowed with rich natural resources and second longest coastline. The fact that Andhra Pradesh is one amongst the top seven states categorized as a top achievers in the ranking of the states and union territories on the implementation of the Business Reform Action Plan 2020 is an indicator that Andhra Pradesh is headed towards an upward growth tra trajectory and is all set to make a great stride in the near future. I pray Lord Jagannath, Lord Venkateshwar, and Ma Kanakadurga for the well-being of the people and the state of Andhra Pradesh to continue to shower blessings on all of us. Before concluding, I would like to quote a few lyrics from the famous patriotic song written by Sri Gurjada. Appa Rao, Deshmante Matti Kadayo, Deshmante Manusulaya. Thank you all.